Hello, I'm Daniel, Ethics and Compliance Officer of SKF Group, and I take care that the ethics and compliance processes, functions and systems are running to support our employees and business partners to feel safe working in and with SKF, to take legal and ethical decisions that stands up for our company values. This includes whistleblowing, data protection, export controls, anti-fraud and anti-corruption and to investigate suspe uh, suspected uh, violations against the Code of Conduct. I'll start this short presentation by a quote from our CEO. As a global company, we have a global responsibility. SKF was founded 1907 in Sweden and already 10 years later a truly global company. And uh, today SKF supplies more than 40 industries in 130 countries from more than 100 factories globally. And we develop and manufacture and also re-manufacture bearings, seals and lubrication systems and related services and solutions. Being a truly global company, we take it very serious to deeply understand the trends and the drivers that impact or have the potential to impact our future markets, regions and industries in which we operate. And we do see sustainability as a business enabler, as a prerequisite for a successful future of SKF. And it must be well integrated into our business strategy and operations. We know that the children who are our future workforce will not accept anything else. And we have also decided to fully embrace digitalization utilizing its power and benefits by embedding technology into our products, optimizing our factories and using it in a way of selling and of working. And we know that using digitalization also comes with a responsibility. So, here you see a representation of SKF over 100 years ago. And today, SKF is a company with more than 40,000 employees over the world as such, SKF represents the global society and that means that we will have both the upsides of the global society such as the advantage of a fantastic diversity and a deep understanding of the local communities, the local markets, the local cultures. But it also means that the downsides of the society are represented in SKF. But we do not need to accept, and we do not accept, that these downsides can go on and grow within our company to make use of our resources, of our employees, for criminal or unethical purposes. And we do have programs and systems in place to detect it and to stop it. Under our sustainability framework, which we call SGF Care, we address our actions to reduce environmental impact, ensure health and safety of our employees, to take social responsibility in the communities where we operate, and to support human rights. As of the human rights impact assessment, where we and as other responsible companies as signatories of, for example, the Global Compact, identify the so-called salient rights, to take extra care of in the value chain, we first try to understand what we're already doing well and what more we can and should do. When it comes to the children, it's been a focus for SKF for several years already. As a main sponsor for Gotia Cup and Meet the World tournaments played around the, glo the globe, SKF has supported and enabled thousands of girls and boys for their right to meet, play and doing sports. Supporting with the trainers and local tournaments, running local sports education programs and games. And the world's largest soccer tournament, the Gotha Cup by SKF, has together with the local tournaments engaged 4,000 children and 1,700 teams from 80 nations. And this is an example of how SKF works with the upsides of human rights and specifically the children's rights to support them to flourish, grow and uh, live their dreams. It needs not to be said, but our children are obviously our future. It's our future 
employees, future decision makers, future lawmakers, and future customers. And they need to be supported as well as protected from exploitation and other threats uh, to thrive as human beings. And just as SKF is fully dedicated to fight corruption, bribery, to fight other illegal and unethical aspects of the global society, it is a natural decision to also support the fight against child abuse and exploitation and other crimes related to children. So, the Net Clean Solution is for us an example of a global responsibility with local impact. We manage the solution as a part of the global compliance operations and the impact is mainly local in the regions and in the countries where ESCAP conducts business. For the past two years, uh, ESCAP has supported authorities around the world to identify and report child abuse ma material using the technology of the net clean solution. So, by addressing both the upsides and the downsides, we believe that we can have a significant contribution to a brighter future for our children and for SKF. Thanks for listening.